Rows of rifles, tons of tree stands, lots and lots of fishing gear, most items confiscated from poachers in North Dakota, and all available to the highest bidder at the RAP auction. If a person gets reported in or caught uh, doing something illegally, hunting, fishing, trapping wise, uh, if the equipment is confiscated from uh, their violation, it can be auctioned off at these auctions. The RAP program works like this. Hunters and anglers or anyone who witnesses a wildlife violation is asked to call the Report All Poachers numbers 800-472-2121 or 701-328-9921. If the violation is serious enough, the offender can have their equipment confiscated by the North Dakota court system and could end up on the auction block. Let's say if, you, if a person goes out and, and takes a double limit of, of walleyes one day uh, and they're caught, it's likely that they will lose their fishing equipment. Money from the auction goes right back into the program, so actually poachers are helping bust poachers. The proceeds of that auction go to help fund the rewards that are paid out to informants. This year's auction contains a wide variety of outdoor items that have been seized over the past three years. We'll have uh, handguns, shotguns and rifles there, uh, over 60 uh, for this auction. We'll have archery equipment, some nice bows. There'll be uh, coolers, uh, fishing rods and reels, uh, there'll be traps, there'll be uh, an ATV and a snowmobile. The auction is not only for confiscated items. There are lots of tree stands that have been abandoned on wildlife management areas and even a few fish houses that have been left on area lakes and are up for bid. This is Tom Jensen, Outdoors.